What's up guys? Good morning. My name is Trevor. Welcome back to the Arctivet YouTube channel. Today we are working on the boys' bedroom. And just to give you guys a little idea of what we're working with here is I've got some plastic up on the door to hopefully keep anything from going out of the out of the door into the dining room. But the plan here is to take all of that out all that plaster up there to over here and then all the way down and replace it with some sheetrock first step was i got the door out of the way it seemed the easiest and uh here real soon we're gonna start knocking this stuff out now um i've got some helpers coming they're a little camera shy so bear with us is we break them of the camera shyness. And first things first, please click that red subscribe button. We need to hit 1,000, and I'm trying to hit 1,000 in, believe it or not, two months. <laughs> I know it sounds crazy. We're almost to 400 right now. That's always 600 more subscribers. I'm gonna be uploading every day. I'm gonna start trying to do every single day. And I haven't quite decided the time that I'm going to upload these videos, but for right now, about 7.30, 8 in the morning, seems to do okay. I will be figuring out a better time after I get some more uh, stats back, some more data, some more analytics, because that's what we need. That's what we need. So help me click that red subscribe button. Go ahead and smash that thumbs up while you're at it real quick, and we will get started. Roll that intro. They seem to have done it. We have three people. Yep. Three fish people. Three people on. Holy cow, guys. I underestimated this a lot. A lot, a lot. So anyhow, here's the time. It is now 11, or I'm so sorry, I can't even read. 10.48, I'm, I'm not tired. We got one piece up there. This is another piece. And these pieces will cover the side. <laughs> now, please keep in mind that this is my first time ever doing sheet rock so it was bound to happen to take some time and to, to learn because that honestly that's what i was doing is i was being taught how to do this and you know it's actually it's not too bad as long as you got a couple people to help you it isn't bad at all the problem is is that this is plaster and lads as i have learned and this oops is the mess that it creates and this stuff you don't want to breathe in when you are breaking it apart now it is pretty fun you get to use a hammer and like a little chisel to cut that and as you guys seen i use my uh grinder which has a cutting blade on it and i just went zip right down and i mean it's definitely probably not like the cleanest thing in the world but this is crazy this is kind of crazy this over here is 14 13 inches and something and this one's 15 and something like from 
the tops. It says, it's just crazy. Something about the old house. That's just how they were made. Kind of neat. A little bit of a pain in the butt to work with. But we got it. So, tomorrow, tomorrow morning we're going to try and knock out some more of it. And just to give you guys a little, a little cue here. I'm not going to give you much. Just a little something. Just a little, oh, yep, yep, that's it. That's, that's all you get. Sorry. No more, no more. But if you are part of my Patreon, which is in my description below, you can become a Patreon and find out what I just showed you. So go ahead, click that button, check it out become a patreon right now i currently have one shout out to you todd thank you bro so with that being said now since it is nearly 11 p.m i need to edit this video smash that thumbs up click that red subscribe button don't forget to ring that bell then i'm going to upload it and you guys will see this in the morning right as i am getting bushy tailed and some coffee and some donuts to begin finishing this. I haven't quite decided if I want to show you guys the whole process tomorrow of doing it. I might throw in a time lapse and then show you the finished product and everything. Plus the budding process. Yeah, I'll probably I'll probably do that. I'll show you guys start to finish. I don't wanna I don't wanna skip like a part and I think it'd be kind of cool. Drop those comments down below. Let me know. If this is something that you do, something that you're interested in, or something that you want to learn how to do, it's it's pretty neat, as you can tell. Give you guys a little lesson here: is you put your screw at the top, one at the bottom, one in the middle-ish, and you can tell mine's not quite in the middle up there, and then one in between each of those, and that is how you properly secure your sheetrock. Yeah, there's a little something good to know. So up here I did three. There's not really, I, I could do some in the middle too, but it's a little overkill with that because it's so small. However, on this bigger part here, you can tell it was definitely needed. And on the bottom, I'll do the same. So there's you a free little lesson on how to put your screws in. And you also want to be sure that you hit a stud and sink it in so it's not you can tell it's sunk into the sheetrock and it's not flush that way when we get the mud out we can cover it up and it'll look great now i'm a complete mess so i'm gonna go get this started uploading actually downloading to my computer once i have that done i will probably do a quick edit and start exporting and then jump in my shower so you guys can't join me there have a great night god bless and we will see you tomorrow for another daily arctic vet vlog and i need to say that in the beginning i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it tomorrow we will start out with daily arctic vet vlogs okay <laughs> it's it's coming in the intro not the outro anymore i'll leave it in the outro why not why not have a good night.